The following video was made for entertainment purposes. This video is not meant to represent the real individuals involved in this video. All voices have been AI generated. Please enjoy. What it is, everyone, it is I, Barack Obama, here with Donnie and Bidenator to play some Mr. Obama, President. What the f man? Hey, whoa, 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 Trump, I thought we told you no swearing allowed. Oh, yeah, I forgot this is supposed to be a family inclusive channel. My bad. Settle down, gentlemen. This is the first video on this channel, after all, so we can let that one slide. I will admit this is going to take a lot of getting used to. Wait, I just realized, are you bald, Donnie? Hey, that is rump, not me, all right? I don't know, Donald. He definitely takes after you from looks alone. I'm going to create a Mr. President the prequel and just slap you in the game and claim that's Broccoli Obama. Okay, okay, I'll actually save you this time. Please do everything in your power to stop associating me with rump, okay? Okay, rump, you got it, buddy. Joe, call me that again, and I promise you, you won't be seeing Joe tonight. See, it's fine, Trump. We saved Rump. You happy? A little bit, yeah. But for now, Rump and I are two separate people, period. Okay, that was unnecessary right there. What happens if you jump into the crowd? Do they parade you with hugs and kisses for saving Rump? No, you kind of just collide with them, except they're the unfazed ones, you know? It kind of makes me wonder if they should be the bodyguards instead. Good going, Bozo. Now you sent him flying into the softest sets of bricks I've ever seen. Sorry I didn't expect the bullet to come so soon. Maybe Rump should have moved out of the way next time. I'm more fascinated by the fact the crowd still seems cheery despite watching Trump, I, 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 I mean Rump getting shot like that. I'll let that one slide for now. I seriously wonder what the crowd is made of. Throwing your whole body into them doesn't scratch them. They're probably made of some sort of vibranium, like Captain America's shield or something like that. I'd be terrified if an entire society of citizens are made of a certain metal that not even gunshots can damage. At that point, might as well send them to the military if they're incapable of dying. Also, what is happening to Rump's legs, bro? It's almost as if they're having a stroke of their own of something. I don't know, Joe, but for now, Let's press on to the next mission. Holy moly, that was a fast bullet and a half. Obama, may I suggest you throw your body at the bullet if possible? Wow. Seriously? God. Look at that body go, bro. Okay, this is getting frustrating. Do I really have to catch the bullet or... Hey, whoa, language buddy. Sorry about that, Donnie. Your counterpart just needs to move out of the freaking way in order to live one more second. Maybe if the bodyguard catches the bullet, then... Oop, there you go. Man, finally done with that level. Finally. I cannot tell you how grateful I am that I am not in Rump's shoes right now. Even if I could move out of the way, a threat of an assassin onto me is kind of unnerving, you know? Actually, come to think of it, why are we playing Mr. President? And why is it, uh, Rump? Apparently, none of the other imposters on YouTube have played this game, so Obama told me. He suggested we give this game a shot, mainly because of the goal being to save Rump, who everyone believes to resemble me in such ways, even though I'd never stand there and willingly take a bullet to the stomach like a moron. Yeah, I'm glad you don't cause, then I wouldn't have to save your freaking rear. But what about the why? Because this game released in 2016 during the election of that year. Donald Trump was up against Hillary Clinton, remember? So glad I got her sorry butt out of the election or else she would have single-handedly wiped the entire country. I accidentally pressed the reset button, guys. Great, now we have to relive this torturous moment again. This game is really pulling my leg here. Wait, I did it? Golly, I thought I grew a beard watching that. Finally, we can get out of here. Okay, wait, what in the world is happening here, Trump? Why are you acting like as if I have done this myself? I have no clue what's happening. From the looks of it, you got way too much cash for your own good if it is all being poured into your mouth. What did I say about associating me with rump, Mr. Obama? My bad, sorry about that. Do you think anyone has ever attempted stealing all of the cash that's just on stage lying around on the floor? Probably knowing the civilians down here. Why and how was I sent flying like that? Maybe because there was nothing to break your speed. Well, at least you got rump that time. I'm starting to believe that the crowd in the room are the fakest I've seen in decades. Never have I ever seen them only produce one sound effect the entire time, even when Rump dies. Donnie, this game was likely produced with a budget of like $50. I'm pretty sure the individual who made this didn't care to program something like that. I hope if there's ever a sequel to this game, my crowd would be realer than, uh, Rump's. I'm sorry, but why on God's green earth did my guy just fall down the stairs? 
Come on, you're a bodyguard. Walking down the stairs should be a baby's level difficulty. Maybe if you'd stop slamming yourself into the wall, this would be a bit more of a breeze if you ask me. Trump, what can I do to get you to handle the controls of this game? You can let me play this garbage in the next video if that ever rolls around sometime soon. A bodyguard who can take a bullet with his bare hands is incapable of not dying to anything that touches him. Are you allowed to hire a new guard or something? Gosh, come on, I'm right there. Just let me knock his stupid rear already. Never have I ever been so sick of the stairs. I can tell Barry's doing everything in his power to not cuss in this video. Yeah, surprisingly, cussing is way more a part of our language than we even realize. Although I find it kind of funny when we have to find words to work around the cussing. At least your guard's got some moves, though. <laughs> Why did I press the retry button again? I swear you're about to make me the richest on earth with the amount of times you keep restarting on accident. Well, at least it wasn't a failed attempt like last time. What the? Are those actually bombs? All right, who in the world is throwing big massive bombs on stage and no one in the crowd is seeing this or doing anything about it? I'm just as shocked as you all are. Why on this game soil has Rump only called for one security guard and not multiple? God someone in the stinking crowd was gonna throw bombs. Is no one gonna talk about how the bombs just destroyed the Rump statues made of gold? $50 game, Joe, remember that. Try knocking Rump by his left side and see if that'll avoid the bomb explosion radius. Oh, actually, that worked out just fine. Thanks, Donnie. You're welcome, Barry. Anytime, bro. Wait, before we move on to the next level, can I see something real quick? What is it, Joe? I noticed Rump is still moving on his own, so I want to see what... I'm suing whoever made this game! Why? I thought you were Trump, not Rump. Shut it, Awamna. This might be one of the best things I've seen in my 80-something years. Okay, seriously, why am I placed in some empty dome and have to crouch to escape to save Rump? I wish I could answer that question myself, but honestly, neither do I know. Nice jump, bro. Shut it, Trump. Nice going. Let's get on with the next stage. Trump, why is your counterpart just waving at the wall now? I'm not associated with that numbskull. Wow, how amazing. Rump's got so much money, he was so thoughtful to put it in my way to make it harder to save his butt. I'm truly praying to God people don't actually see me as they see Rump, because on God, would I let him get assassinated if this happened to me? I don't know why, but I feel you need to watch your tongue there when you say something like that. Welcome to another episode of I Can't Walk Down the Stairs because I'm Rump's bodyguard and I belong in a game with no budget behind it at all. <laughs> I hope you understand how frustrated I am with this game, Joe. Sorry, something about that was just funny. Whoa, nice Barry. Amazing job at sweeping his legs to save him. Thanks, Joe. I seriously hope that was the last level for you because I'm actually getting sick of seeing Rump and that annoying face of his. The irony of that comment. Haha, <laughs> good one. Mr. Barack Obama, do not pretend like I don't know where you live, you son of a- Okay, that's gonna wrap it up for this video. Despite my suffering, I hope you all enjoyed this video. This was kind of annoying to play, not gonna lie. If any of you wanna see more of us playing whatever games we get on our plate, please be sure to like and subscribe for more. It helps us and Jared Gaming to produce more of these kinds of goofy videos. Don't expect these videos quite often. Jared and us already have a lot of business to attend to, especially me. As always, take care. And, and God, God bless, bless you all. You all.